Welcome to this Android channel and today we're going to talk about something that a lot of people are asking your questions. Should I have a antivirus or you know some kind of protection in my Android phone? Um, quick answer to this, probably something that you can scan your phone with. But I don't believe a antivirus that actually does real-time monitoring is necessarily a good thing especially a lot of the phones that are out there running Android are a little sluggish they don't have you know a lot of performance plus the fact that the battery life is affected if you have a real-time antivirus scanning type software so what I would actually say is yeah you can have something and I think maybe it's even a good idea to have something um, if you, of course, are careful with what you do on the internet and what, what you do and just go get your apps in the Google Play Store, yeah, okay, you're, you're, you're already pretty safe. And um, the need for antivirus is not necessarily very high. But I would certainly say that something that you can use to scan your system from time to time is not bad. I use um, Malwarebytes anti-malware for Android. But only the portion, you know, I don't, I don't have the live scan feature or anything. I only have the manual scan feature. So basically, the free version lets you scan your system, um, your Android phone, when you wish to do it. Uh, I think that's the way I would do it. And I'm, even though I've got a you know, powerful phone that I did try um, a, you know, I did try the 30-day um, live trial where it's actually doing protection in real time, and um, it it didn't I didn't see you know much performance changes, but yet I am very very reluctant to actually tell you to install something that scans in real time. Um, I'd rather have something that will be there because I think yeah it's a good idea to have one, but it's um, a good idea to have one that you just use to scan from time to time. Remember that the security part of your phone is really up to you what you do with your phone. That means what you do is really the key aspect, like on a PC of your security. If you're careful, the need for an antivirus is very low. Um, and remember that antiviruses don't detect everything. There's some stuff out there that aren't detected properly. But at least you can, uh, you know, have a little something to scan you know I it's it's interesting because malware bytes that I used actually told me that for example a couple of apps that I had downloaded from the Google Play Store had um, adware which means they had you know ads that could be running not just within the app but outside of the app um, that 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 is interesting because it told me that some of the apps in the Google Play Store are a little bit you know on the uh, doubtful side on security um, and you know if I if you play of course you you go outside of Google Play Store start installing apps or APK packages uh, then it's a must-have you need to have something like that to make sure that you are safe as safe as possible so um, it's up to you but I don't think a real-time paid antivirus is necessary um, I will talk about some of them I will actually have videos on a couple of antiviruses that might be of interest um, free ones I do not believe in paid protection um, like I said you're the protection and so we'll have a few videos talking about that if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching